Let's keep it at God's speed. Day one of practice this year was so much better than day one last year. Simone Walker is your living proof why. Last year, today, you know, I tore my ACL the first 15 minutes of practice. So we got through that today. We did. That is good. Walker enters 2018-19 as one of 15 Griffins in uniform. So this is where we start developing that toughness. It's a lot crowded. So that's a lot of kids to manage. And that's a wonderful thing. Let me tell you, I am so excited to have so many players. Like, <laughs> I remember last year, I'd look over at the bench, I'd be so tired, and it was just doesn't matter. It's incredibly hard to encapsulate what happened here one year ago. A 9-1 start, followed by disaster. It had to have been every game, somebody was falling down, somebody was going down. Injury after injury, followed by loss after loss. Maniah Timpson's fouled out, they don't have any more players. They only have four players. Get your heads in there! You got Do not let your heads get down! There were multiple low points from multiple perspectives. The loss at Northwest, I haven't lost to Northwest since I've been here. That was probably the rock bottom for me. Probably at Hayes, the freaky leg whip thing happens to Jess and, and she goes down four minutes in the game and thinks she got an ACL tear and you're just like, holy crap. I came to a game last year and I sat behind the bench and Coach Ed was actually like, he was yelling at the players and then he looked at me and said something to me. My dad was right to the left and he kind of laughed at me and I was like, what did he say? <laughs> I was kind of scared. So there you go. You got, you got a taste of it before you were even here. Yeah, I don't know if he remembers, but I do. <laughs> when the regular season ended, Missouri Western had lost 15 of its final 16 games. Every one of those games was close. Then, the unbelievable happened. The first ever last place seed to knock off two nationally ranked teams and make a run to the conference tournament semifinals. When they got there, that was their chance to do something to, to make it right, and they did. Tough times don't last, but tough people do, you know. Everybody's better off for it, if, you're, if you learn from it. The 2018-19 season will not be a rebuild, but a repair. People don't realize the kids that finished up, four out of five still had to have surgeries that were on the floor. Uh, this little bump on my shin turned out to be a stress fracture, so I got a big old metal rod in my leg. To be honest, just like everything else that happens in life, you just kind of to push through it, so that's what I'm going to do. This is the best depth that we've had since we've been here. Even as a youngster, closing ruckus on the back of the bus. I was a fool all through high school, kicking up dust. But now Six newcomers complement nine returners, and because of all those injuries, some of the most talented returners will be new again. You know, it's what they're going to make it if, they, if this team, we, it's not a talent deficiency, it's just going to be, can we get, you know, the chemistry we had last year at the end. And there's a big difference between having chemistry when you have to have it and having chemistry when you've got 15 people and you're battling for jobs now. Everybody knew they were going to play last year. Got my mind on danger. But even if health, experience, and chemistry creates a perfect recipe, there will still be unquestionable adversity because this season's MIAA conference may be the best it's been in history. Defending national champs that lost one player. And the top five teams in the league just didn't lose anybody. Because I'm sitting in a league where sixth place team can, can go in a national tournament and, and win games. Our, our ninth place team last year won the conference tournament and got the NCAA tournament. We are very fast. We're going to be a quick team. I think we'll be able to hassle a lot on defense. My expectations are the same as every year. I want to win. I want to be a top team in the conference. My goals are the same every year. Win the conference, win the conference tournament, and go to the national tournament. What I've experienced in Missouri Western is going to stick with me forever. Am I going to appreciate, though, every day I have left here? Yes. Oh, wow. Whatever it takes. There you go. <laughs>